Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf, your one and only, and today we're going to be playing Pokemon Revelation Online. Now this game has been out for quite a while. It's pretty much free to play, and it's been pretty much in live beta right now. So you guys can go to their site and download it. I'll leave it in the description for you guys to check it out. Now they have three servers at the moment. At first, when they first started, they didn't have three servers. They only had two, and that was blue and red. So this is pretty much a revisit to the game and somewhat a uh, first impression because I didn't really play it all that much and I kind of regret not playing all that much. So I'm going to go back and start playing it a little bit more. Now the company Pro or Team Revelation are no in no way affiliated with Nintendo, Creatures Inc or Game Freak. They even have it down here to where you guys can see the whole copyright thing. Now. Without further ado, we're going to get into the game and see if we can actually, you know, do some things. Wow, no queue timer. They used to have queue timers because there are always a lot of people trying to get in on this game. But it appears that some people are still at school, so I have plenty of room to actually get in. Now we're talking to Professor Oak here. Now you can use your mouse and your directional keypad. So you can use your spacebar to keep going. It's pretty much welcoming you to the Pokemon world. Now the game is still in development and it has full character customization. Now I'm gonna go with that. Why not? I got hair black. I would go green, but you know, that seems troublesome. Now my skin color and clothing. I'm a green type guy, so let's go with that. Alright, turn back around, buddy. I believe those are glasses, right? Oh, nope, those are eyes. They look like glasses at first. Alright. Now we've created our character. You can go feeble or male, so do keep that in mind. Now we're just automatically into the game. We can fully move around with our arrow keys, our WASD, and our mouse. But your mouse has to be dragged in a certain direction. As you guys can see. Now we're going to go down here. You guys can drag it and hold it down. But you can't like. Move it around too much. Or it'll just get stuck. So. Rip. Now which way are we going? Oh look. There's a little Dratini down there. In the water. <laughs> now I don't remember all the Pokemon's names. I pretty much remember most of the Pokemon's from. The first. 150. 51, I believe. Now, I remember a lot of them, uh, what they look like, but not all of them of their name. Is that a total though? Why is he in the water? Oh, Professor Oak, there you are. What's up, buddy? You use space to talk to them, or you can probably click on them, which we're going to see next time. All right. Apparently, I have to go talk to my mom. Here we go. Oh look, a zigzagoon, or... Wait, which one are you? I'm pretty sure you evolved from zigzagoon. I think... I, I can't remember your name. I know it starts with an L, though. Oh, Mew. Mew just disappeared out of nowhere. Oh, come on. Alright, this should be our mom. Now, let's see if we can click on her. Yep, you can also click to interact. There's a Pokemon battle going on. As you can see, there's Megas in the game as well. So you guys can actually Mega Evolve, which is actually pretty awesome. Developers are putting a lot of time into this. It is really cool that they're making this. Now, it's not like a real profit games or anything like that. Like, it's actually free to play, guys. You guys can actually go out and try it. Alright, let's see. Those are just Pokeballs. Can't you really do anything with them, so we're gonna go downstairs. Oh god. Oh, I thought we were gonna go downstairs. No! We're gonna talk to our mom again. Drop by Professor's Oak house. Alright, let's go talk to Professor Oak. 
It's snowing out here. Now this is an NPC. You can tell by the yellow, yellow name and how you can't like collision with him. Now we can talk to him, but he won't go into our Pokédex until we actually get our Pokédex, which we have to talk to the Professor for. Professor is always at the bottom right of every game. There are three Pokeballs. Four of them. Oh, the Pikachu is in the back, I believe. So you start out with the normal starters from uh, Generation 1, I believe. Bulbasaur. Wait. I believe this is Generation 1. Charmander. And then there's Squirtle. And Pikachu is in the back with the little Thunder symbol on his Pokeball. I can see it's Pikachu. Now, do I really want to go with Pikachu though? Nah, let's not go with Pikachu. Let's go with... Uh, if you want to go with Charmander like everybody else, nah, we're going to go Squirtle. Why not? Let's go Squirtle. Now let's talk to the professor again. Now he's gonna give us our Pokédex. Now the fun thing is that any Pokémon you see around, you can actually put it into your Pokédex. Oh god. All right, it just took control over my character and just took me straight to my mom. Jeez, come on, man. So now I have to talk to her and tell her that we're going away. Oh god, she's sad. Yes, I'm growing up. I, yes, I would love money, to be honest. Thank you. Bye. Love you too, mother. Oh yeah, gotta get the items upstairs. Those two Pokeballs up there. We got five Pokeballs and five potions. Sweet. Ah, uh, they have one of my favorite songs in this game. Now let's go talk to this Eevee over here. Now the Eevee has been... Oh, God. Oh, it's somebody else's Pokemon. Okay. Okay, that's why his name was yellow. Okay, Jackson, I'm sorry. I didn't try to take your Pokemon. It was just sitting out here all by itself. Oh, oh well then. You didn't have to push me, you jerk. Not cool, man. We're not even pro, bro. As you see, we talked to Jinx, and now she's in our Pokedex. So any Pokemon you see around just randomly, just go ahead and click on it, put them inside your Pokedex. Okay, somebody just left. Somebody just dipped down there. Because they have Surf. And we don't. Now, I believe that's a... Wait. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, there's no more Pokemons here. Except for the Lapras that is just sitting over here. But we can't get it. Rip. Well, let's keep going. Jackson, you're a jerk. Just hope you know that. Wait, I already talked to the talked about the Eevee. Ah, oh, now I have to battle him. Bring it, Jackson. Now this is a whole battle system. You guys are pretty familiar with it. Here's your attack and your items. Your Pokemon. And you can run. You cannot run from a po from a trainer battle. Now here are our, all of our moves. It's pretty much like the standard. You can hold four. There's still quite a bit of strategy to the game. Oh dear God! I really need to kill this guy. Oh oh oh! Oh, I have an Ordenberry somehow. Where did an Ordenberry come from? Oh, I leveled up, so who cares? <laughs> yep, 
Yes, I am a skillful trainer, but you don't have to call me pathetic, bro. We're gonna throw hands again. So I thought you better run. All right, so let's continue on. We're out of this area and go on to the main game. Now it's pretty much just like a normal solo game, just pretty much like an adventure. You could trade Pokemon, you could sell them for, I guess, cash, maybe? I have no idea. People are like, want to sell, so you can sell it for cash, or you can trade. I'm gonna talk to this old guy over here. Oh, well, he does nothing. Oh, but there's a Butterfree. Okay, he didn't get put it in my Pokedex, but okay. Now we can walk through the grass, still pretty much encounters a Pokemon in them. Make sure to talk to everybody. They give you different stuff. And they brought back the whole old planting berries. Now these berries will only show up for you, not for other players. So you can actually come back here and pick them up without players, without being worried about players will come by and take them. So it's pretty much like your own adventure game, but with multiple people around. Alright, got the Raichu. There's a Pichu over here too. Hey, Pichu, be still. You too, Pikachu. Now we got the whole set of them. We can move on. I don't know. Should I make like a walk playthrough of this? Seems like a fun thing to play through. Maybe in the future. But what is this guy doing? Okay, this is Butterfree got in my Pokedex. There's a Beedrill. And there's a Ratatat. Okay, yep, there he is. Uh, hey, hey. Abra, be still. Uh, but he doesn't get in my Pokedex. Pidgeotto. And nothing else. Now these trees things, you can see the little sleeping symbol. You have to have a uh, headbutt for it. I don't have headbutt, so rip. Nah, I don't have it, so we're gonna move on. Now, this is our first city, but first we're gonna talk to this to this woman. Talking about an oddish. But I don't I don't have that. Whoops, looks seems like I'm gonna go get a Pidgey. Hey, hey, don't make that face at me. I just don't have one. I'm gonna talk to this oddish right quick and put it in my Pokedex if I can. Yep. But first, we're gonna go into town and pretty much see what's all this up here. Now, you can, you can go into buildings. I wonder if they would add housing to this game. How, adding housing would be nice. Now we can go to the basement and fight Jackson. But we don't have multiple Pokemon because Jackson will pre, eh, pretty up there. He, I believe he has multiple Pokemon last time I checked. Well, last I remember. Hello, youngster. What are you doing? I want to know two types of Kelpie. I already know about those. All right, let's go heal our Pokemon. This is pretty much the standard Pokemon Center. NPCs and come up here to your little well thing that's not unlocked yet or probably still working now here's your PC where you can place different Pokemon your storage and stuff I haven't used it so I wouldn't know how that works just yet but let's hell out Pokemon thank you nurse joy I'll be out after I talk to these people. Hey. Yeah, I know. I can only carry six. Hello, officer. What's up? Oh, subway system is not working right now. Okay, so that's still in pretty much either still in work in progress or it could be not available to us yet. Hey, hey, hey. 
Ah, uh, well, I will go get some chocolate. Alright, as you can see, some people have different color names. I guess that's just because they've, like, paid for it. You get bonus items for donations, so that's pretty nice. This biker guy going around. Let me talk to him right quick. Hey. You, you don't have to tell me to move. Could have been polite. And here's your Pokemon Market. Or Pokemark. Now, you can buy everything over here. I have quite a sum of money, which I start out with. Since I'm pretty sure your mother gives you some. But we're going to go... Pretty much up. I'm pretty sure there's a mission up here. Pretty sure that old guy's still in the middle of the road. Uh, no. I'm pretty sure he stops us from going on beyond his point. I gotta check out the school and beat what's his name? Jackson. Yes, I know. I talked to Pokemon and they. Get in my Pokedex. Pretty much just chatting with everyone. Alright, let's go catch a Pokemon. I know there's a couple over here. And yes, I believe this is the Elite Four over here. The same path to the left. That's what it gives me like a reminder of. Looks like it. Alright, let's see if we can find a Pokemon. Oh, we found a Hoot Hoot. Sweet. I'll definitely be catching you. Oh god, you outspeed me. Pretty sure you have Hypnosis too. Item. Pokeball. Don't you do it. Sweet. We got him. Now the neat part is, whichever Pokemon's in your first is the one that travels with you. As you can see, my Hoot Hoot is now following me. Now we've got a Primate inside of our Pokedex. So let's switch back to our Squirtle. Hey, Oddish, you're in the way. Let's keep seeing what's up here. There's a... Mankey at the bottom. Pretty sure this is the Elite Four. Yep, finish your badges. Yep, this is definitely the Elite Four. Probably Victory Road. Hello, Mankey. Get inside my Pokedex. Hey, hey, hey. Come here. Come here. Oh, I need a run. Hey. Okay, sweet. We can now move on back. Pretty much heal our Pokemon. This is pretty much a normal Pokemon you all know and love. Except for these guys try to keep it up to date as much as they can. Thank you, Nerdjoy. You're always happy as usual. Now I'm going to get out of your hair. Okay, I, I heard you. Can I leave now? Thank you. Oh, that guy had a skull mask. That was pretty epic. Alright, let's go up here. Wait, no, we got to check out the school. Let's see how tough Jackson is. Right here is a school right behind here, I believe. Yep. We have to beat Jackson to continue on, so bring it, Jackson. Yeah, it's me. I might just 
try and take your EB. Oh god, level 8? You're definitely gonna outspeed me. Really hope my hoo can kill you. Oh yeah, you can move the screen around and everything. I don't think I'm high enough level to beat this guy, so... Probably gonna have to go back out and train a little. Man, that's one strong Eevee you got there. I wonder what it transforms into. Let me guess, Leafeon? Maybe try and put you to sleep. Oh god, yes. Yes, we put him to sleep. Oh, come on. Go back to sleep, bro. Oh, it looks like I could be dead here. Ripping pepperoni. So we're gonna go out, and I believe we lose money, too. Oh, nope. He's like, never come back. But we're gonna go train some more. You know, put on some of that good old training music. What the? Let me... What? Oh. Ah, so we want to call his parents. You know what? Why not? I'm a sore loser. Let's go get his parents. I'm going to go snitch. Why not? Oh god. Youngster Bill! How could you? I thought we were friends. Do we really have to fight now? Darn you. So you would have to use your mouse just to um, navigate. So that's a downfall. But not much of one. I feel sorry for those whose mouse don't work. But yeah, I'm gonna give you guys a bit of information really soon after this. About your like specs and everything. This game is pretty low on running. I believe the highest they had to recommend was like 2 gigs. So remember you don't actually have to have 2 gigs. But it's recommended that you have 2 gigs. But I'm going to put up the specs for you guys right now. As I'm done talking to Bill. So here are the specs. Now you can... Played on Android and desktop, and the systems that it works on are Windows, Mac, Android, and Linux. So you guys can actually enjoy the game. Minimum graphics are pretty much there. Pretty much there, and it's not really all that bad. Now they do have both 64-bit 60, and 32-bit. So you guys can pretty much try that out. Now, on Android, it gives you a recommendation of it too, and you need at least 1.15 gigs for your Android, and that's RAM. For your CPU on the phone, you would need 1.5 gigahertz, or dual core or better recommended. The graphics support you would need for it is pretty much will probably be OpenLG. The operating system you will probably need for your um, Android will probably be Android 4.4 KitKat or later, a later version. Now for your PC, like I was saying, you guys can use Windows Vista or Mac. And you guys can see you would probably need DX9 or higher. And uh, it's pretty much works on older computers. Everything made since 2004. So yeah, you guys will probably be good. 
And if you guys have a worse computer than that, and rip you. But you guys can still try it and see if it works. That's up to you guys. But, with all that said, pretty sure we're running out of time right now. First, we're gonna go finish on tattling. Okay, stop talking to me, Bill. I'm trying to go tattle on Jackson. He has been bullying me, and I'm going to go tattle. Just you wait, Jackson. Just you wait. Oh, just you wait. I'm almost there. Oh, wait. This is his house, I believe. <laughs> Rival. Rival's house? Jackson's mom. Yep, he's causing trouble there. Go go get him. Haha. -ha. Sucker, I win by default. What, that wasn't the best way to win, but it was the only way to win. I play to win. Even if it's not fair. <laughs> Alright, let's let's pretty much get rid of this guy. Or I can catch him. Please don't break out this Pokeball. They are valuable. Thank you. Thank you, mate. Now we can go and keep going on. Now what they do have is also PvP over here. PvP, you can find a match and just pretty much match up with anybody. And they have your backpack over here. Which pretty much have everything in separate tabs. Your trainer card. We can put on your different costumes and everything. And they have social, where you can pretty much find your friend list, talk to your friends, emotes, guilds. Oh god, I took off my clothes for some reason. What is wrong with me? Alright, I right clicked it back on. Now you have PvP coins, how long you played, if you're if you have membership or not. Yeah, and pretty much these are all your badges you have to earn, so. There's probably multiple regions as well. And they do have a shop where you can buy mounts. As you can see, that guy's riding on an Arcanine. As you can see, these are all the mounts you can ride at the moment. Pretty sure they have, they're gonna probably have more. They have consumables for HP increase and etc, etc. And they have headwear to where you can customize your character. As you can see, I can put on glasses and all that. I can put on a Pikachu Flushy and that skull mask that guy had. They have quite a few things. Now you can buy it from picking Get Coins, but it will take you straight to a PayPal. So if you have a PayPal, you should be good. If you don't, then hey. <laughs> now you can put on Team Rocket costumes, like, and I can put on a vampire costume as well. I can put on a. Sh I guess that's a snowman costume. It looked like a chef costume at first. I can put on a kimono as well. Put on a Turk chick outfit, Team Magma, etc, etc. That is pretty much all the costumes they have and everything they have to offer right there. As you guys can see, there's different regions as well. Johto, Kanto, and Hono. I believe that's how you pronounce it. And the islands down here, which I Okay, there we go. That's pretty much all they have right now. So pretty much all these are gems, all these are gems, and... Gems somewhere else on this, on this world somewhere. But everything is still a work in progress. This, remember, this is actually still in beta. Live beta for you guys, so... I do recommend you guys check it out. At the moment, it's nighttime. For some reason. I don't think it has, like, actual real time. But you know... Hey, okay. as you can see, they'll tell you what Pokemon you can catch in this region. Well, in this area, so... Do remember that. But, I guess it's time to wrap it up, guys. Well, wait, no. We're gonna go see how Jax is doing before we wrap it up. Because that jerk deserves to get tattled on. Not tattled on? Tattled on. Okay, Butterfree, me and you are going to throw hands. You're blocking my path, and that is triggering me. Alright. Just you wait, Jackson. I'm almost there. 
Mom's gonna have a long talk with you. You and those signed papers. Right. Hello. Okay, she just went downstairs. All right, let's go. Let's go watch the show. He should be angry. The principal rejected your application. Oh, oh. So he's pretty much there for no reason. Aha! I tattled on you. How do you feel? Yep. Yep, it's me. Yeah, I can't deal with defeat, but I still technically won in a way. I won by heart. And by training later on. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed the whole, you know, revisit. But I will see you guys next time on the next revisit or first impression or Twin Saga gameplay. So, did it? Peace out.